Hello everyone, como es la I'm Jasmine, thank you so much for coming to my channel today. This is gonna be a very exciting video. I'm, I'm interested to see how this is gonna work out because this is my first time doing this ever on this channel and that's basically me trying on a wig that I can wear for an everyday. You know what I'm saying? Really quick, if you are not subscribed yet, please do. I make videos every couple of days. For now, I wanna say I feel like my schoolwork is really trying to kick me in the butt, so I might lessen it to once a week. I am a full-time student, I work full-time, and I'm doing YouTube, and I'm married, and I have a family, and I have this, and I have that, and I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to balance it all, okay? Uh, this is actually the only day within the week that I have time for myself and to, you know, tidy up the house and all that stuff. And that's another thing, girl, we're gonna, we're gonna have a whole nother conversation about adulting. Today, this video is about this finger comber wig. So um, I got my package on Tuesday. I'm filming this today, the day that you're watching this on Thursday. The reason why I wanted to get a wig is because, I mean, I love my loose natural hair, don't get me wrong, however, I don't wanna have to do it every day. And I know that there are protective styles you can do, but I just wanna have my hair away sometimes, especially when I'm at work. I, I don't want my hair to be exposed to the elements all the time, you know what I'm saying? So I think a hair hat is definitely understandable. So one of my girls, mainly on Instagram, but she also does YouTube, her name is Ijama. Cola, and she's the one who told me about the finger comber wigs. Previous to me knowing about this, I was looking on some other websites and their wigs were like $300, $400. I'm not spending $300, $400 on a damn wig. This was reasonable. This was about 80 bucks. I mean, it's still quite expensive, but the fact that you can, you know, clean it and maintain it and it it's not supposed to, I don't know if it's supposed to go bad or not, I really don't know, but the fact that it was this price and the fact that it looks so natural, I was like, you know what, let me give it a try. I'm gonna open up the box really quick. This is the box that it comes in and the models, like I was looking at all the pictures of this unit, this finger comber, I don't know what this, this is just the finger comber unit. Okay, I, I don't know, look, I don't do wigs like that, so I'm just like, talking off the dome. The way that the, the pictures looked of these women wearing this wig, it looked so natural. And it looked very similar to my hair texture, which is like 4C, whatever. I used Ijama's code to get an expedited shipping. It came within five days. And mind you, they didn't know I'm a YouTuber or anything like that. It comes wrapped like this. And this is this is it, sis. This is it. So you would take care of this as you would take care of a delicate sweater. This smells like something I know for some reason. This is cute. Alan is very, very hesitant about me rocking a wig. He seems to think that all wigs are straight. And I'm like, no, B, it's not. And I can't wait to show him this. I'm gonna go, go. I'm gonna go to school. I'm gonna show him what I'm gonna rock. So I think. I think. Wait, where's the back? Where's the front? I don't know. Is this the front? I don't know. Okay. I'm gonna put this on. Let's go for it. Okay, sis, um, should I spritz it? This, um, this looks quite interesting. I don't know what to make of this, sis. I don't know if I want to, um, am I doing this wrong? I, wait. I don't know if I want to comb it out per se, but I feel like I have to. <laughs> I 
could this be a fail? Maybe I'm moving too fast, right? Let me, let me untwist. Okay, um, well, you know what? You, you know what? It's, it's okay. I think, um, I think I can figure this out. So, yeah, I do have some, f some stuff that I left out in the front. I'm trying to figure out if I could tell. Well, I could definitely see this right here. Let me just wet it some more. Just... So, I mean, it ain't bad now that I'm looking at it. Now that I like fixed it, finagled it, it kind of looks natural. It's a cute little, cute little situation. I'm mad though. I'm taking these like hairpins right here. Um, I'm just gonna like secure it. <laughs> okay, right, let me, I don't know what the back looks like. <laughs> I can't even tell from here, okay. <sighs> All right, look, I'm gonna go into the bathroom real quick and see how this looks. I will come right back. I mean, it's not that bad. I mean, can you tell there's a difference? I mean, I can tell there is a difference between my hair texture and this unit hair texture. However, it is very, very slight. And you would have to be looking at me really, really hard to like, tell the difference I feel like maybe I would need to stretch the front of my hair a little more just to match the the smoothness of this unit this unit is a little bit shinier than my regular hair but the fact that I'm not having too much of my hair out I mean like it really I really don't see a difference like that really quick I chose the color chestnut black and that is supposed to be similar to 1B. I am the color 1B when it comes to like hair color. So I end up getting this and it's shipped from Pennsylvania in case you were wondering. Yeah, so I ordered it on the 12th and I got it on Tuesday. I don't remember what day Tuesday was. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't take too long to come to me. I actually, I actually quite like it. I do. Kind of looks like uh, a lion's mane. Because everything looks bomb.com with earrings. Okay. It's like a weird shape over here. Yeah. All right, so I have not much else to say. I mean, it looks natural from what I'm looking at. The only thing I feel like I would need to do is do a two strand twist in the front, let it dry, and then try to blend in with the unit because I mean, my hair looks kinkier than the finger comber unit itself. So, yeah. I will let you know further down the line whether or not I still like it or not. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. Please turn on your notifications. That way, whenever I post a video, you will be the first to know. Share this video with your friends and your family, sis, because sharing is caring, okay? Especially in the month of February. I wanna thank you all so much for watching and supporting and subscribing to my channel, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace. Ouch.